Hey guys, so in this video I'm going to show you how to upload a video lecture that you recorded um, using any tool such as Screencast-O-Matic um, to YouTube and then embed that YouTube video into your course Moodle page. Um, the reason we are going through YouTube first versus directly putting the video into Moodle is to help uh, maintain sort of the, the size uh, file size capacity um, that we have on Moodle. Um, if all of us start uploading our videos directly to Moodle, um, we will um, sort of fill up the space really quickly. Um, so our recommendation is to go to YouTube and then take the embed code from YouTube and put it into your Moodle course page. All right, so um, let's go ahead and get started. So what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and launch your YouTube studio space. Um, if you already have a Gmail account, um, um, you can log in um, and create an account with YouTube very quickly. Um, so when you go to YouTube and you sign in um, with your account, um, you have sort of these icons up here to upload a video to your space um, or your channel, so to speak. Um, you're going to click on the little camcorder and you're going to say upload video. <clears throat> And then what you're going to do is just select the file that you want to upload. So this is the screencast lecture demo that I just did for you guys. Um, I'm going to upload that and then show you how I embed it. All right, so I'm going to open this one. All right, um, we're going to put in a title. So I'm going to say um, recording lecture using screencast. Omatic. Um, give it a description. So this video will demonstrate how to make and save a lecture to your computer using Screencast-O-Matic. All right. Um, one thing they make us do now is that we have to select whether this was made for kids or not. So you're going to say no, this was not made for kids. Um, don't worry, this won't restrict it. We can still say no, do not restrict my video to viewers um, that are only 18 or over. Okay. Um, now what's happening is it's uploading in the background. Um, it's going to take a little bit to process. It already upload, uploaded. I'm going to hit next. I'm going to hit next again. I'm going to select public um, so that everybody can access it. Um, and then I'm going to select publish. All right. And what's going to happen is now my video is processing. So I'm going to go ahead and pause here um, while this processes. This can take about 10 or so minutes to process in the background. Um, and once it's done processing, we'll pick back up. All right, guys, so now um, my lecture video has finished processing on YouTube. Um, so you can see finished processing. So I'm going to select close. Um, and now there's my video right there, right? Um, I can click on it. Um, I can watch it real quick. Um, like this, right? So y'all remember that video? Okay. All right. So now that it's ready, I'm going to show you how to embed it um, into your uh, Moodle page. So um, you can always go back and edit your video details as you need to. I'm going to click save. And then I'm going to go to my, my channel. <clears throat> All right, so here's my channel. This is the collection of all the lecture videos that I have on hand. Um, and I'm going to um, select click on this video um, it will start automatically playing let me pause that all right so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click share and what I want to grab is the embed code um, so let me show you that again so I'm gonna click share embed code and then I'm just gonna select copy and that's gonna copy the embed code of this video now I'm gonna go to Moodle and I'm gonna go to the Moodle course page that I want to embed the lecture video into. So I'm gonna to go to, I'm gonna actually embed this one. And I'm gonna to go to the how-to videos. And I'm gonna select create learning activity. 
All right, once I have create learning activity up, um, I'm gonna go to resources and I'm going to select page. All right, I'm gonna give my video a title, demonstration on making a lecture video with Screencast-O-Matic. Um, I'll come back and give it a description in a minute, but um, basically this video will demonstrate so on and so forth. All right, now with the page content, I'm embedding an HTML code. So in order to do that, I have to click this little down arrow to show my advanced features, and then I'm gonna click click on the HTML code. Once I click on that, um, my window will change and you'll see these green letterings. Um, I'm going to paste, so control V, the embed, the embed code that I copied um, from YouTube. Once I do that, I can click save and return to course. All right. And if I wanna check out to see how did the video embed, um, I can come here, click read more, and there's the video right there. So now the students don't even have to leave, you, um, leave Moodle in order to watch the video. They can interact with it um, right here on the course Moodle page. And since it's being housed at YouTube, which is completely free for us because um, we're education, um, uh, it doesn't take up um, sort of our Moodle space capacity here at BSC. All right, um, if you have any questions, as always, please feel free to reach out to either uh, me, Amber, or the IT team, uh, Matthew Cook or um, Greg. We are very much happy to help you. Um, and, you know, good luck as we continue this transition.